Ever imagined a horse that's worth more than a fancy sports car or even a small island? How about a horse that's pricier than the entire GDP of a country? Yes, you heard that right. In today's episode of Forever Green, we're galloping into the world of the most expensive horses ever sold. From a horse that cost a whopping $70 million to another that's worth a fortune, these aren't your average neighing neighbors. They're the superstars of the equine world, each with a story more fascinating than the last. So hit subscribe and let's get into the world of luxury on four hooves. Better Than Cheddar, $2.3 million. First up is Better Than Cheddar, a standard bread with a name that's a cheesy pun, but with a career that's no joke. Sold for a cool $2.3 million, this horse wasn't just trotting around for chump change. Why did he fetch such a price? Well, it's all about his racing record, which was more impressive than finding a needle in a haystack on the first try. Better Than Cheddar was known for his lightning-fast hooves and potential as a breeding stallion. Think of him as the Usain Bolt of the horse world. But instead of gold medals, he was chasing carrots and glory. His sale year might not be widely publicized, but let's face it, with a name like Better Than Cheddar, he's hard to forget. He's a reminder that in the horse racing world, being better than cheese or cheddar is a pretty big deal. Announce $2.4 million. Next, we trot over to Announce, a thoroughbred who was sold for a whopping $2.4 million. Now, why was Announce so expensive? It's all in her genes and potential. With a pedigree that could make other horses neigh and envy, she was like the horse version of a celebrity child destined for greatness. Her sale might be shrouded in a bit of mystery, but her value on the racetrack was as clear as day. Announce was not just another horse. She was a four-legged investment, galloping her way into the hearts and wallets of the racing elite. Her potential on the racetrack made her the equine equivalent of a hot stock tip, except way prettier and faster. Announce's story is a testament to the fact that in the world of horse racing, potential can be just as valuable as performance. It's like betting on a startup that could be the next big thing, except this startup has a tail and loves to run. Imperial Falcon, $2.5 million. Now let's swoop into the story of Imperial Falcon, a standard bred with a sale price that soared to $2.5 million. Why did this majestic creature command such a king's ransom? It's all about his racing prowess and potential as a sire. Imagine a horse so swift it's like he had wing, hence the name Imperial Falcon. His performances on the track were more than just running in circles, they were akin to a master class in equine athleticism. But it's not just about speed. His potential to sire future champions made him a veritable gold mine on four hooves. Think of him as a high-speed investment with a mane, galloping his way into the annals of horse racing history. While the details of his sale year might be as elusive as a falcon in flight, his legacy in the racing world is crystal clear. Forestry, $3.3 million. Next up is Forestry, a thoroughbred who was more than just a pretty face in a fancy gate, Sold for a forest-sized fortune of $3.3 million, this house was a living, breathing, galloping testament to the phrase, pedigree and performance. Why was he so expensive? Picture a horse with a racing career so successful, it's like he was born to win. Forestry's value came not just from his own achievements on the track, but also from his promising lineage. He was like the equine version of a celebrity born into Hollywood royalty destined for stardom. His sale might not be the stuff of bedtime stories, but in the horse racing world, he was a legend in his own right. Forestry's story is a reminder that in the world of thoroughbreds, a champion's worth is measured not just in race wins, but also in their potential to sire the next generation of winners. Lord Sinclair, $3.4 million Let's prance into the tale of Lord Sinclair, a warm blood with a price tag that's as noble as his name. A majestic $3.4 million. Why did this equine aristocrat command such a princely sum? It's all about his dressage abilities, which were more graceful than a ballerina in a horse suit. Lord Sinclair wasn't just trotting around, he was performing equine ballet, making him the Mikhail Baryshnikov of the horse world. His potential as a breeding stallion added to his allure like a royal matchmaker's dream come true. Imagine a horse so talented in dressage that he could probably dance the waltz if you put the right music on. While the exact year of his sale might be as mysterious as a royal secret, his reputation in the dressage world was well known and celebrated. Lord Sinclair's story is a dazzling reminder that in the world of horses, 
grace and lineage can be just as valuable as speed and stamina. Poet's Voice, $3.6 million. Now let's gallop over to Poet's Voice, a thoroughbred who fetched a lyrical sum of $3.6 million. Why was this horse more sought after than a best-selling poetry book? It's all about his success on the track and his potential as a sire. Poet's Voice was like the Shakespeare of the horse racing world, turning every race into a sonnet of speed and agility. His value wasn't just in the races he won, but in the poetic potential of his future foals. Think of him as a four-legged muse for the racing world, inspiring dreams of future victories. While the specifics of his sale year might be a bit hazy, like a forgotten verse in a long poem, his impact on the track and as a breeding stallion was crystal clear. Poet's voice's story is a testament to the fact that, in the equine world, a horse can be both an athlete and an artist, galloping not just to the finish line, but into the annals of horse racing history. Sardar, $4.7 million Next, let's canter over to the story of Sardar, a thoroughbred who galloped his way to a cool $4.7 million. What made Sardar worth almost as much as a small island? It was his strong racing performance and potential for breeding. Sardar was like the Usain Bolt of the horse racing world, except with more horsepower. His speed on the track was matched by his potential off it, making him a dual threat in the equine market. While the year of his sale might not be as well known as his racing record, his value to breeders and racing enthusiasts was crystal clear. Sardar's story is a powerful reminder that in the world of horse racing, speed and lineage go hand in hand, or rather, hoof and hoof. His sale wasn't just a transaction, it was an investment in a legacy of speed and success. Seattle Song, $5.2 million. Let's gallop into the melody of Seattle Song, a thoroughbred whose sale price hit a high note at $5.2 million. Why did this equine virtuoso command such a symphony of dollars? Seattle Song was not just any racehorse, he was a maestro on the track, orchestrating his races with the finesse of a seasoned conductor. His racing record was like a chart-topping hit, and his potential as a breeding stallion was the encore that everyone awaited. While the exact year of his sale might be a bit of a hidden track, his impact in the racing and breeding world was loud and clear. Seattle's song story is like a beautiful ballad in the horse racing world, reminding us that a horse can be both an athlete and a legacy, racing not just against others, but also against the sands of time. Mystic Park, $5.5 million. Now let's trot into the mystical realm of Mystic Park, a standard bred whose price tag was an enchanting $5.5 million. What made Mystic Park the horse equivalent of a fantasy novel hero? It was his performance and breeding potential casting a spell over the racing world. Mystic Park was like the Gandalf of trotting, wise beyond his years and majestic in his stride. His ability on the track was matched only by his potential to sire future champions, making him a wizard both in and out of the racing circuit. The details of his sale year might be as elusive as a hidden treasure in a mythical land, but his value in the racing world was as clear as a crystal ball. Mystic Park's tale is a reminder that in the world of horse racing, magic isn't just in fairy tales, it's in the bloodlines and the heart of a champion. If you've enjoyed this video so far, be sure to check out more amazing horse content on the Forever Green channel. Dive into the world of these majestic creatures, and if you like what you see, don't forget to hit like and subscribe for more equestrian adventures. Plavius, $9.2 million. Dive into the story of Plavius, a thoroughbred whose sale price was a whopping $9.2 million, making him more valuable than some of the world's rarest gems. What made Plavius the equivalent of a walking treasure chest? It was his illustrious pedigree and the promise of his racing abilities. Plavius was like the horse version of a luxury sports car, sleek, powerful, and born to perform. His lineage was so impressive, it could make other horses neigh and awe. While the specifics of his sale year might be shrouded in mystery, his potential on the racetrack was as clear as a sunny day at the Kentucky Derby. Plavius' story isn't just about the races he ran, it's about the legacy he carried, a legacy that made him a multi-million dollar equine sensation. Totalus, estimated $9.5 to $15 million. 
stride into the extraordinary tale of Tadalus, a Dutch warm blood whose price tag was as astounding as his performances, estimated between $9.5 and $15 million. Why such a staggering sum for this equine superstar? Tadalus wasn't just any horse, he was the dancing horse, renowned for his exceptional dressage performances. Imagine a horse that could dance with the elegance of a prima ballerina and the precision of a seasoned athlete. Toddlers set numerous world records, making him the Michael Phelps of the dressage world, but with a tail. Sold in 2010, his fame wasn't just in his steps, it was in the way he revolutionized dressage, turning each performance into a spellbinding spectacle. Toddlers was more than a horse, he was a living legend, an equine artist who painted a new picture of what a dressage horse could be. Jaleel, $9.7 million Now let's prance into the narrative of Jaleel, a thoroughbred whose sale price reached a sky-high $9.7 million. Why did Jaleel command such a king's ransom? It was all thanks to his desirable lineage, making him a blue blood of the horse world. Jaleel was like the equine equivalent of royalty, born into a lineage that promised greatness. His sale wasn't just a transaction. It was akin to acquiring a piece of horse racing aristocracy. While the exact year of his sale might be as elusive as a royal secret, his value in the breeding and racing community was undeniable. Jaleel's tale is a testament to the fact that in the world of thoroughbreds, bloodlines are worth their weight in gold, and a horse with the right ancestry is a living, breathing, galloping legacy. Snuffy Dancer, $10.2 million Step into the spotlight with Snoffy Dancer, a thoroughbred who danced his way into a staggering $10.2 million sale in 1983. Why such a monumental price tag? Snoffy Dancer wasn't just a horse, he was a groundbreaking phenomenon, being the first ever yearling to be sold for more than $10 million. His breeding was the stuff of legends, making him the equine equivalent of a celebrity born into Hollywood fame. However, Snoffy Dancer's story took an unexpected turn as he never raced due to his lackluster performance on the track. Despite this, his sale remains a historic moment in the horse racing world, a reminder that sometimes the promise and potential can eclipse even the reality. Maiden City, $11.7 million Now let's trot over to Maiden City, a thoroughbred whose sale price of $11.7 million in 2006 was nothing short of spectacular. This horse was like a walking, neighing gold mine thanks to his exceptional pedigree and the high hopes pinned on his racing potential. Maiden City was sold as a yearling, a young star with a future as bright as the Dubai skyline. His lineage was so impressive it could make other horses turn green with envy. While his racing career didn't quite match the high expectations, his sale remains a landmark in the world of horse auctions, symbolizing the immense value placed on potential and bloodline in the high-stakes game of horse racing. Palube de Halon, $15 million Gallop into the extraordinary tale of Palube de Halon, a Cell Francais show jumper sold for an eye-watering $15 million in 2013. Why was this horse more valuable than some luxury yachts? Palube de Halong was not just any show jumper, he was one of the world's best, a true maestro in the arena. His performances were so breathtaking, they were like watching a live action equine ballet. His sale to Jan Tops, a former Dutch show jumper, was a testament to his incredible abilities and the high regard to which he was held in the show jumping world. Palube de Halong's story is a soaring leap into the reality that in the world of equestrian sports, excellence has a price, and for some, it's worth every penny. Seattle Dancer, $13.1 million Finally, let's prance into the saga of Seattle Dancer, a thoroughbred who fetched a princely sum of $13.1 million in 1985. What made Seattle Dancer the equine equivalent of a luxury mansion? It was his extraordinary breeding. As a half-brother to the legendary Triple Crown winner Seattle Slough, Seattle Dancer was horse racing royalty from the get-go. His sale was not just a purchase, it was akin to acquiring a piece of racing history. While his racing career was hampered by injuries, his value in the breeding shed kept his legacy alive. Seattle Dancer's story is a rich tapestry that weaves together the importance of lineage, the unpredictability of racing, and the eternal hope of what could be in the world of horse racing. Annihilator, $19 million Charge into the saga of Annihilator, a standard bred whose name is as formidable as his sale price, a whopping $19 million. Why such a colossal sum for this equine powerhouse? 
Annihilator was not just a horse, he was a racing marvel, known for his exceptional capabilities on the track and his potential as a sire. His speed and agility were the stuff of legends, making him the Usain Bolt of the standard bred world. His sale wasn't just a transaction, it was like buying a piece of lightning, fast, powerful, and awe-inspiring. While the specifics of his sale year might be shrouded in mystery, his impact in the racing world was crystal clear. Annihilator's story is a thunderous reminder of the sheer value placed on speed, strength, and the potential to sire future champions in the world of horse racing. The Green Monkey, $16 million Now let's leap into the tale of the Green Monkey, a thoroughbred whose sale price of $16 million in 2006 set the horse racing world abuzz. What made this horse worth more than some private jets? The Green Monkey was famed for his incredible speed in a Florida workout session, setting records before he even hit the racetrack. His pedigree was top-notch, and his early showings promised a future star. However, the Green Monkey's racing career didn't quite live up to the sky-high expectations set by his sale price, making his story one of potential unfilled. Despite this, his sale remains one of the most talked about events in horse racing history, a testament to the high stakes and big dreams that fuel the sport. Sharif Dancer, $40 million Dance into the narrative of Sharif Dancer, a thoroughbred who waltzed away with a staggering $40 million in 1983. Why was this horse more valuable than some blockbuster movie budgets? Sharif Dancer's value lay in his extraordinary lineage and his impressive performance in races like the Irish Derby. He was the epitome of equine excellence, a horse that combined strength, speed, and stamina with the grace of a dancer. His sale to Maktoum Al Maktoum of Dubai was not just a purchase, it was an investment in a living legend. Sharif Dancer's story is like a dance of the equestrian world, where pedigree, performance, and prestige come together in a mesmerizing display of horse racing glory. Fusechi Pegasus, $70 million Finally, soar into the epic of Fusechi Pegasus, a thoroughbred whose $70 million sale in 2000 made him more valuable than some small countries' GDPs. Why such an astronomical price? Fusechi Pegasus wasn't just a horse, he was a phenomenon. As the winner of the Kentucky Derby in 2000, he captured the imagination of the racing world. His pedigree was impeccable, his performance on the track was awe-inspiring, and his potential as a breeding stallion was unmatched. His sale to Coolmore Stud was like acquiring a crown jewel of the racing world. Fusechi Pegasus' story is a galloping testament to the dreams and aspirations that race through the heart of the horse racing industry where champions are not just born, they're made. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Forever Green for more incredible stories and adventures. Happy trails until we meet again.